to finish this up because uh, it needs to be stated. It needs to be it needs to be brought out. A lot of confusion about this, and I'm gonna I'm just gonna finish it up right now. So, Brendan, okay, you are a mentally ill, sick person. We've proven that. If you weren't mentally ill, then why are you so freaking obsessed with me? You are more. You pro, you're probably the most mentally ill out of the bunch of them. You and Harmon are about neck and neck. You and Harmon are about neck and neck about being men, mentally ill. On your YouTube account, you got pictures of me on your account, on your avatar, and on your screen. Pictures of me. Harmon, you have a picture of me as well. Most of you sick individuals out there that you know that say that this, that, and that, and, and that about me, you have pictures of me on your screen. I mean, well, I mean, what the hell is up with that? I mean, and, and, and I have to say this, Brennan, there, there's no doubt in my mind that you are a homosexual. There ain't no doubt in my mind. And I asked your mother that, and she even told me that you were a homosexual. So I thought I'd just let you know that. Okay, you're sitting there, you have so many flaws, so many freaking flaws about you, and you're sitting there, have the audacity to stalk me. And you've been, you have been cyber-stalking me for a long time with Harmon, Miller, and I'm going to get into Miller in just a little bit. Miller, Danner, the whole, and, and, and the whole rest of them. Okay? This is, like I said once before, a psychosis. It is a psychosis. A bunch of sick individuals, sick and demented individuals that have no freaking life but to sit there and cyber-stalk. Okay? Sit there and cyber-stalk me. Your eye candy. Brennan and Harmon, you're the two that I'm gunning for. Miller, you're right there also. Danner, keep running your mouth because you're going to find out something as well. I am sick of this. Okay? I am sick and tired of this. Okay? You all think that, oh, well, you haven't done anything. I am going to do something. I'm a busy man. I am a really, really busy man. And believe me, I am going to do something about this. I'm an entertainer. I'm a comedian. I'm an entertainer of sorts. I'm a comedian. Okay? I do my show. All right? Eventually, I'll get my break. Eventually, I'll get noticed. Okay? I've got people out there that know me, that know that all this stuff on the Internet is false. All this stuff on the Internet is totally false. And the people out there who really know me know that. This is a way for the self-loathing SOBs, the self-loathing son of a bitches, to get on here and start attacking me. You get on here and attack me, your eye candy, your man crush, Okay, you're a mentor because you are self-loathing. You're self-loathing. You have no social skills. You all are a bunch of pathetic losers. Brennan, going back to you, you know, you, you've got to be the sickest one of them all. And then being behind on an internet, being behind, I don't know if Miller was behind this or one of you all were behind putting a post of me on Craigslist, okay, asking for sexual encounters. Need I not even get into that? You get into my real world, okay? You put a listing on Craigslist posing as me. If that ain't criminal, I don't know what the hell is, okay? All these things, all these things that are being done on the internet, they are on the tier of being criminal, slander, and libelous. And best believe, I'm not sitting around taking this lying down, okay? I don't like to get in put much energy in this. You got a bunch of people that are mentally ill that think about me morning, noon, and night, and that's part of the problem, okay? Whether I have a show or don't have a show, these are sick, demented, mentally ill people. We just had something that happened in Colorado a few days ago. A guy went, goes into a movie theater and guns down 71 people inside the movie theater in Denver, Colorado to a Batman movie. Now, I don't see much of a difference compared to these sick, demented people. That if they had the opportunity, they would probably take, get their aim or try to do something. If these people had the opportunity, okay, they would probably go ahead and, and use a weapon. I don't put anything past these people, okay? Ain't stretching too far. The man in Denver, Colorado, who was a nerd, who, who was allegedly a nerd, goes in a shooting spree and kills 18 people, innocent people, in a movie theater, watching a Batman movie. There has got to be these people that do this stuff. There ain't no second chance. That's why I am for the death penalty. That's why I believe if you commit a crime, you do the time. Okay? These people are stalkers. 
Okay? These people are cyber stalkers. And the problem we're having is that the police don't know much about how to go about cyber stalking, how to get these people taken care of, whether it's a jurisdiction issue or not a jurisdiction issue. That's the problem. I mean, for the lack of what I'm doing, the police are, it's gray matter to the police, whether what to do about jurisdiction issues. Okay? But you see, I'm not going to stop. That's the only thing that's slowing me down. That's the only thing that's slowing me down right now. But I'm not going to stop at doing what I need to do. And because I haven't done anything, you wait because you haven't seen anything yet. You think I haven't done I haven't done anything? Maybe I haven't done anything. But I'm going to do something now. I'm taking the bull by the horns and I'm going to do something now. Okay? Best believe that. This shit is going to come to an end. The copyright material Everyone I find, it's going, to, it's going to come out. And YouTube needs to get more vigilant and take this hate stuff off. This hate stuff recently has been an issue that's been lagging with YouTube. YouTube, you need to get off your ass and take this hate stuff off. That's the bottom line. Okay? I am a citizen. I'm a private person. Okay? No one needs to endure this. These people, these trolls, if you will, attack this kid in Rutgersville, Virginia who's autistic, Chris Chandler, or Chris Chan. This kid, or this guy, cannot do anything for you. cannot de defend himself. He can't defend himself because he's autistic. These people prey on weak people, okay? But I am not weak, okay? And you're thinking that by me doing something or responding that it's getting a reaction? No, you're not getting a reaction. I am stating the obvious. There is no reaction. You think you're getting a reaction about me responding. I do what I will. I do what I want to do. No, nobody tells me what to do. I do what I want to do. And this right here is stating the facts. All this slander, all this libelous is going to stop. It's going to stop. You know why? Because I say so. Best believe that. Brennan, I've got one coming right at you. Brennan, <laughs> you're pathetic. Okay? You are mentally ill. And I'm going to take care of this. You've done enough. Okay? I'm going to take care of this. Best believe it. And, Harmon, <laughs> heaven, I'm going to get you. Harmon, I'm going to get you. I'm going to take... You're going to feel something. You're going to feel the wrath. Okay? I haven't done anything. Just you wait. I haven't done anything. Just you wait and see what I'm going to do. Alright? And, Miller. How can I forget Miller? Driving by my house when I haven't been home, putting up stuff on the internet, saying you're going to beat me and you're going to challenge me. You know what? Miller, I haven't forgotten about you. Miller, you're part of the equation as well. Danner, keep flapping off with the gums. You'll be added on. And whoever else out there, whatever else infinite, insignificant loser out there that wants to, be, wants to jump on this. Okay? Jump on this and you're going to get, something's going to happen. All right, I'm not going. To, I'm going to do it in good time. But when I do it, my eyes are dotted and my T's are crossed. You all are going to know something. Okay, it's not going to be to your liking. You're going to feel. You're going to get. You're going to get back your medicine. You're going to feel something. It's going to be a heavy dose of reality. When you get into someone's real world, that's it. When you get into someone's livelihood, you cross the line. And I'm going to put an end to this once and for all. Best believe it, this shit is coming to an end.